Hi guys and welcome back to 2C aka 2 Footballs Combined and the season starts tomorrow. Fucking about time. This has been a very boring summer without proper football. Women's World Cup was good so I take the proper football back but still. <sighs> it's back. It's finally fucking back. And as I said in one of my videos, I can't remember which one. One of them the other day. I'm going to do predictions every week. Just the Premier League. Maybe cup games. I'm not 100% yet. Um, I might just do the Premier League. It's 38 videos throughout the year then. Um, I'm just going to predict the scores. See how close I can get. Um, <clears throat> and what I'll do, I'll kind of recap the previous week in my next week's predictions. Just to kind of see where I got. And see how good I got. Um, if there was an app, I'd say join the league. But there isn't. I'm hoping that something might come about next year. Hopefully, fingers crossed. Maybe I'll, I'll try and set something up. But we'll see. Um, so yeah. Premier League predictions week one. So tonight, uh, Friday night. Liverpool versus Norwich to kick off. The season, I am going with Liverpool 4, Norwich zip. Norwich have got a very hard task in front of them to even stay up this year, let alone face Liverpool first game of the season at Anfield. That's just madness. So yeah, I'll, I'll go with Liverpool 4, Norwich nil. Early kickoff on Saturday. <clears throat> West Ham versus Man City. West Ham have been spending money. Will their players gel in time? Well, we see it last year when I said, oh, will they Will they gel? They did. They played pretty well, but it was the beginning of their season that let them down. We shall see how this season goes for West Ham, but I reckon Man City will win this, but I don't think it will be a whitewash. I reckon it will be 2-1. I reckon 2-1 City, we'll see how that goes. Then we've got the three o'clock kickoffs. We've got Bournemouth versus Sheffield United to start us off. Uh, I've got Bournemouth 3 0. Sheffield United have just been promoted, trying to find their legs back in the Premier League. I think they're going down, like I said in my predictions my, for my league. If you haven't seen it, go and have a look. <clears throat> but um, yeah, I reckon Bournemouth are a, an established Premier League team now. They've been up for a few seasons, so I don't see. Don't see them struggling against Sheffield United. 3 0. Uh, boom, uh, Burnley versus Southampton. I'm just going with a one all draw. I don't know how either are going to play. If I was going to get off the fence and not say draw, I'd say Southampton win. But Burnley at home are normally that kind of team that won't, won't lay down and take it. So we'll see. We'll see how that goes. But I've got one all on that. Palace Everton, oh god. Um, I'm saying this because the last time I remember Everton haven't won at Sellhurst in so and so years. So I'm just going to stick with a draw and say two all. Fuck it, why not? Watford Brighton, I reckon Brighton are going down this year as I have stated or did I say that they were going down or did I say they almost go down? No, I did say they were going down. So uh, I reckon they're going to start off shit and I reckon Watford are going to start off well and win 2-0. They're at home, so why not? Uh, late game, Saturday, Spurs versus Villa. I reckon Villa are going to stay up but they're against a very well-managed Tottenham team. With some very good players and a couple of decent signings. I say decent, fucking world-class signings in the past week. So, we'll see. I know today is transfer deadline day, so a lot of shit can change. But I don't think Villa will win this. But I don't think they're going to get blown out of the water. I reckon maybe 2-0. 2-1, 2-0. But I'm going with 2-0 down on my sheet. Then we've got Sunday's games. We've got Leicester versus Wolves. Both, I reckon, are going to do well. I'm going to stick on the fence again and say a draw. Um, go one all. Fuck it. Why not? 
Newcastle versus Arsenal. Newcastle are a sinking ship. Um, especially under fucking Steve Bruce. I don't reckon they're going to do anything. And Arsenal, uh, like I said, I reckon they're going to finish top three. So I reckon they're going to start off well. And I'm going to say 3-0. i say 3-0 Arsenal. Possibly Newcastle might get an early goal, late goal, something like that. Make it 3-1. But I'm going to stick with 3-0. And then we've got the big game. Man United versus Chelsea. Ex-player versus ex-player in Ole Gunnar Solskjaer and Frank Lampard. Uh, both legends of the club as players. We shall see. So far, Ole's lucky to still have a job. Um, but we'll see. We'll, we'll see. I reckon this could go... This could be the highest scoring game of the uh, the weekend. I reckon this is going to be a 3 all draw. Don't know why. This could end up fucking being nil-nil because defence, defence, then not too bad. But my feelings are that certain players for United that didn't play so well last year, aka Lukaku, Sanchez, um, yeah, those are the only two that I can think of that are actually, I reckon, going to have amazing seasons. <clears throat> I reckon Alexis Sanchez, after his Copper America stint, He's got taste for goals. So hopefully, well, for my for my dream team anyway, hopefully he scores a lot of goals, sets them up. So we shall see, but I'll go through all with that. I will go for that. But yeah, those are my predictions. Let me know what you guys think of my predictions and let me know what your score predictions will be in the comments. Uh, if you are new, subscribe. I'm still aiming for 500 subs. Like, Don't think I've forgotten. If you're... A normal 2FC follower, watcher. You know I've been wanting 500 subs for at least a year now. Over a year. Still haven't got them. <laughs> but to be fair, don't upload, don't get subscribers. Shit happens. But yeah, I want 500. That's kind of where... That's I don't give a shit after that. Like If it goes up and goes up, then awesome. But 500 is where I want it at. Like If I can hit like 500 views per video as well. Just one view per subscriber, I'll be happy. But we'll see how that goes. Yeah, those are my predictions. Thanks, guys, for watching and peace.